Hello guys, uh, welcome back, Pokemon Moses here, and today I'm bringing you something very, very special. Um, you may notice that there's no real backgrounds or anything, because we have just this big box in front of us. And this box has come from S.O. Resistain from Twitter. Um, he's a great guy I've been trading with for quite a while now, and this is by far the biggest trade I've ever done. Um, this is in the thousands of dollars now um, from what I've managed to trade. I'm going to show you what's inside the box. As you can see if I bring it down, I've not yet opened any of the seal. And we will get started. We do have a lovely customer form from Parcel Force saying it's been damaged. So let's see see what happens there. Um, I'll just go open it up for you now. Getting very eager to see what's inside here. I know some people I've been talking to have uh, some thoughts as to what we would be expecting. Uh, let's see what we do now. Right, so if I pop the box just over here. So first up we have is a Blastoise kind of promo break um, blister thing. I think I did get sent one of these before from SO Resistane. Comes with the EX break kind of gold packs, it's cool. Next up we have an EX break box. Let's see what we've got in here. I can pull it open. So let's see what we have. Okay, get this last one open there. Oh, just a box. Pop that over there. I believe this is probably just packaging boxes, the looks of it. Yeah, packing your boxes. So Onto the real stuff now. So here we go. So we have this lovely padded brown envelope. Just slide this in here. I don't want to cut anything that's inside this. And we have quite a few cards now. If I just nip behind the camera. Oh, knocking it over already. So, let's see what we have in here. There's quite a few already. I can get that last one. And we'll pan it down. So, first up in our little pack. We have a first edition Celebi Gold Star, which is very nice indeed. Let's put that to the side. We have a lovely Kabutops Crystal Hollow. So I don't know if you can see the little sparkle there, that's really nice. And a Suicoon Gold Star, that is also first edition. Gotta love the Suicune. I did pick up a Suicune Neo. Uh, is it Neo Discovery? It was a Neo Suicune, but unfortunately it was very damaged uh, in English, so I'm pretty good about that one. We next have a lottery promo Charizard. I know a couple of guys on Instagram are looking forward to seeing this one. So as you can see, it's looking very, very nice. That one's very cool. And again, we have the other two lottery promos. There was obviously six in total, but we have the Kanto Evolution starters. Again, these two looking very, very nice indeed. Can't seem to see any marks on those. So that's the first little packet. I'll just open up the next packet now. This may be stuff that helps towards my CP6 collection. Get it open, right. 
So, starting off with the Promo Snorlax. Looking cool. We have a Pocket Monsters. Uh, this is the Card Ass Mew and the Gyarados. Um, SO Resistine did send me a complete collection of the Card Ass cards and he kindly offered to add these in as extras to replace the damaged ones I already had. We have... I can't remember for the life of me what this trainer is, but it's part of CP6. Another promo card, which is awesome. Next up we have the Mega Pidgeot EX. I think I already have this one, but it doesn't harm to have two. Oh, we have a Venusaur EX on the back as well. So I did pull this one as well, and you may see in some next videos coming up that we may see a lot of this guy. We have the standard Pidgeot EX. Um, trying to think if I actually pulled this or not, I'm not sure. I've had so many CP6 boxes, it's unreal. And Nido King Break there, looking very nice. Next up is a Tyranitar EX, Full Art. So this will go towards my Full Art collection that uh, uh, SO Resistine is helping me out with. And we have another CP6 in the Pidgeot EX Full Art. Looking very nice indeed there. So I think I've only got about 15 or 16 cards left of CP6. We have the Prima Pikachu. Looking all fat now, it's awesome. And the promo Charizard, which was a reprint of this CD Charizard, I believe. So that's just part of that package there. Let me go grab the rest of them now, see if I can stand some of these up. Like so. Right, so we have one big package. Two big package. I get the third one out. And three. This almost looks like it's drugs. So let's see if I can push those back and open this one up. And this is better than drugs. So CP6 booster boxes. Are back. Of course, these are the first editions. So, pop that up away. And we have two more. So, there's four there, and as you can imagine, we have more and more boxes. And there we go. Four more. And create a nice little display of these now. Right, pop all these just at the back, and we have the last package. Again, we'll contain the same contents. Another four. Very nice, I think we've opened eight CP6 boxes already. So there's all of those there, so we have 12 CP6 boxes in total. I did trade some of these for a, I think it was a case of the Pokemon Evolutions. Um, so that's probably why I've got 19 boxes. Some of them are going to Japan. We have another brown package. Also quite heavy. We don't get this one open. Oh, I think I know what this is. I think we forgot the head Oh yes, it is. So we have the art books, the illustration books from Japan. Um, I think these come with the Charizard on the front, so the Charizard 
EX, although it should probably be a Venus or EX because Charizards get destroyed there. So these are looking pretty cool. Um, it looks like it says it just on the back there that it has the Charizard card there. So those are pretty awesome. Pop those like so. I'm not too sure what this is. I think I have a, another CP6 booster pack there, it's cool. So we got CP6 booster pack. Um, can't remember the name of this one, but it's the Steam Siege equivalent. Got those back there. And this is very interesting. So this binder here has the original 151 Cardass collection, as you can see. Um, this will be my second set from SO Resistane. He managed to kindly collect me another set, as one of my friends at work wanted a, this set when he saw it as well. You can see it's the original Fat Pikachu. And just quickly show you the book. All looking quite cool, and they have really nice classic artwork. I mean, look at that Meowth. Look how silly that drawing is. I think one of my favourites here is the Gengar. Once we flick to him. Uh, where would he be? He'll be in the next couple of pages. So he's coming up just now. And he's always cool because he's eating Snorlax's dreams. Quickly flip through to the end. Oh, let's get the page there. So they're always nice as they have this kind of, it's almost like the break card hollows on them, which makes them stand out a lot more. So there's a full set there of the Hard ass cards. Let me pop that just to the side. Pop it over here. Um, oh, knock our stuff over. I'm trying to think what's left now. So we have this greenish package. What is there? And a cool pocket monsters. I think what this is. It's a sleeve thing. So it shows you all the. Oh, wow, it has every single classic pack on it. So this is very nice. It starts off with the Steam Siege equivalents, breakpoints, and so on and so forth. And it goes all the way to Gym Heroes over here. Um, so, would that be the original? base packs in Japanese, that's pretty cool. So thank you very much for this, that's awesome. Just put that to the side. Um, not too sure what this is. So let's open up and see. Oh yes, I do remember. We have a normal kind of Neo binder. So you can see with the Raikou, Suicune and pick that up, Entei. So that's pretty cool. Oh, that one's falling over the back. And another Neo binder with the Umbreon. And we have a little Pichu down the corner. This one comes with some cards. So that's also a very nice background. As you can see, a little Eevee back there. So that's everything from the box. I'll just pop this the side and clip this out now. There we go. So we have the Neo binders just here. Looking awesome. We have the 
nice freebie in Blastoise CX. We've got all of the CP6 boxes there. A couple of extra booster packs. Lots and lots of cards. Um, two of the art books and then a full card hour set. And that's it for today's video. This is probably by far the biggest trade I've ever done. Um, I'll be sure to try and get some uh, more out of this and then see how we go with SR Resistain. Thank you all for watching and I will speak to you all soon. We have a Draphic. It's an uncommon. How rare is it? Oh, we have an Aeglish. So that's pretty cool. Um, that's another three points on the tally. So I think we're on seven now. So that's something. We got an EX out of these. So I'm quite happy with that. We're